Would you like to learn how to fill in information in just seconds when you create and use a drop-down list in Excel 2016? Rod here, and welcome to Burn to Learn. Stay tuned because today you will learn how to do just that. First, let's create a drop-down list for positions in a company. This takes three steps. Step one, create your list. In this case, the list will have areas and sub-areas. Then step two, we need to name our list in our workbook. And here's how. Go to Formula on the menu bar, then click Name Manager. Now click New. Name the list. In this case, the name will be Areas. And select the range where Excel will identify the list. And then step three. Now select the range where the drop-down list will appear and then go to Data on the menu bar, click on data validation, then click on settings, and then allow lists. Now go to sources and type an equal sign followed by the word areas, which is the name of the list. Be sure to type exactly the same name. Then click OK, and we've created a drop down list. Now you can use the drop down menu to fill in the information you want in just seconds. OK, so far you've learned how to make a drop down list. Feel free to comment and like this video at the end when it's over. Now what if we want to create submenus to our list and have the submenus correlated to our first list? In order to do that, we have to learn to use the indirect function in Excel. Here's how. Select the range where the drop-down list will appear. Then go to Data on the menu bar and click on Data Validation and then Settings. Now allow lists and go to sources and type an equal sign and the word indirect followed by an open parenthesis. Now write cell L5 and a close parenthesis and click OK. As you can see, now the sub areas have drop down menus and you can fill in the information you selected previously using the drop down menus in mere seconds. Imagine the time saved and the personal aggravation avoided by using what you've learned today when working with large databases with thousands of pieces of information. If you liked this video, remember to comment, share it, and hit the like button. And please take a few seconds and subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching.